In the wake of a vacation that stirred considerable debate among the public and media, Queen Mary Donaldson and King Frederick X of Denmark have sought to project a united front, emphasizing their dedication to their royal duties and the welfare of the Danish people. Their recent retreat, closely followed by allegations and public scrutiny, has brought the royal couple into the spotlight, underscoring the delicate balance they navigate between their private lives and the expectations of their royal roles. King Frederick's accession to the throne, marked by a lavish ceremony amid swirling rumors and speculation, cast a shadow over the royal family's image. The emergence of photographs featuring the king with Genevieve Casanova during a notable visit abroad had ignited a firestorm of gossip, threatening to overshadow their work and commitments to the nation. However, with a strategic public appearance and a heartfelt declaration, they managed to quell the immediate whirlwind of rumors, though the episode left lingering questions about their unity and the impact on their public duties. In a bold move to reaffirm her commitment and to shape her narrative, Queen Mary has scheduled a series of engagements that spotlight her role not just as a monarch but as an advocate for social causes and a figure of inspiration and leadership. Her decision to attend an event in Germany to support the Danish handball team, despite the personal challenges she faced, was a testament to her resilience and dedication to representing Denmark on the international stage. The upcoming engagement on February 29, where Queen Mary is set to appear solo for the first time in her capacity as Queen of Denmark, is marked with anticipation. This event, focusing on rare diseases, is not just a ceremonial duty but a reflection of her personal commitment to health and social welfare issues. Though not listed on the official royal calendar, her participation has been widely anticipated, signaling a fresh chapter in her royal duties and public engagement. The Danish royal couple's approach to their recent holiday, opting for a secluded family time in their Swiss Alps chalet, has been met with mixed reactions. The property, nestled in Verbier and known for its luxury and privacy, became a subject of controversy regarding its financing and the transparency of the royal family's expenditures. Despite these challenges, Frederick and Mary's choice to prioritize family time amidst their demanding roles highlights the modern monarchy's attempt to balance public expectations with personal needs. This incident, coupled with the scrutiny of their marriage and public roles, underscores the evolving nature of royal duties in the face of modern challenges. The Danish royal family, like their counterparts across Europe, is adapting to a world where the lines between public service, personal privacy, and societal expectations are increasingly blurred. As Queen Mary prepares for her solo engagement and the royal couple continues to navigate the complexities of their public and private lives, their actions are a reminder of the multifaceted responsibilities that come with modern monarchy. Their commitment to social causes, national representation, and the well-being of the Danish people remains at the forefront of their agenda, even as they seek to maintain a sense of normalcy and privacy for their family. The coming years will undoubtedly present further opportunities for King Frederick and Queen Mary to demonstrate their dedication and leadership. Their ability to engage with the public, address societal issues, and represent Denmark with grace and integrity will continue to define their legacy and the relevance of the monarchy in contemporary society. Amidst the evolving landscape of royal responsibilities and the ever-watchful eyes of both the Danish populace and the international community, King Frederick and Queen Mary's strategic approach to their roles showcases a nuanced understanding of their position in the 21st century. Their efforts to navigate the complexities of modern monarchy while addressing the needs and concerns of their nation are indicative of their commitment to service and adaptability. In the near future, Queen Mary's engagement with health and social welfare initiatives, particularly her focus on rare diseases, is expected to bolster the royal family's image as accessible and empathetic leaders. This emphasis on health issues not only aligns with global concerns but also personalizes the monarchy, bridging the gap between the institution and the individuals it serves. By championing such causes, Queen Mary aims to leverage her platform for positive impact, underscoring the potential of the monarchy to contribute to meaningful change within society. Furthermore, the Danish royal couple's decision to engage more openly with the public through social media and other modern communication channels reflects a strategic pivot towards transparency and relatability. This digital engagement allows them to share moments of their personal lives, charitable work, and official duties, fostering a deeper connection with a global audience and reinforcing their relevance in a rapidly changing world. As they move forward, King Frederick and Queen Mary are poised to undertake a series of initiatives aimed at environmental conservation and sustainability, 
reflecting a growing global emphasis on combating climate change. Their involvement in environmental advocacy and projects demonstrates a forward-thinking approach, aligning the monarchy with urgent global priorities and showcasing their commitment to safeguarding the planet for future generations. Additionally, the royal couple's focus on education and youth empowerment is set to feature prominently in their agenda. By engaging with young Danes and international students, they aim to inspire a new generation of leaders and thinkers, emphasizing the importance of education, innovation, and social responsibility. These engagements not only highlight the monarchy's role in promoting educational excellence but also in fostering a sense of civic duty and global citizenship among the youth. In navigating the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead, King Frederick and Queen Mary's leadership is characterized by a blend of tradition and modernity. Their efforts to address contemporary issues while upholding the values and traditions of the Danish monarchy exemplify a dynamic approach to royal service. As they continue to define their legacy, their actions will undoubtedly shape the future of the monarchy and its role within Denmark and beyond. The years ahead promise to be a defining period for the Danish royal family, as they continue to adapt, engage, and lead in an ever-changing global landscape. Through their commitment to service, advocacy, and representation, King Frederick and Queen Mary are not only cementing their legacy but also ensuring the continued relevance and vitality of the monarchy in contemporary society.